an asshole. Good to see you again, too, Jim. Now, if I let you up, you promise you won't punch me again? Well, seems like a losing proposition if I don't. What's your word, Jeb? What makes you think that's any good, Jonah? It's always good enough for me. Go on, then. All right. I need your help, Jeb. You're kidding me, Ryan. This is a joke. You killed me, Jonah. You drew on me, Jim. Yeah, well, that was a mistake. Well, obviously. You disobeyed a direct order. To burn down a hospital? Your father was gonna murder them people just to make a point. I couldn't stand for that. I'm surprised that you could. He was our commanding officer. He was my father. I didn't have a choice. Neither did I. Sorry about it. Killing you, I mean. I never did expect things would turn out that way. You took my family in your name, Jeff. You made me watch them die. I gotta find them, Jeff. I've been watching you. And I've been watching him. Truth is, it's getting real hard to tell the difference between you Your two. Your father is a monster, you hear me? And you ain't? From where I sit, you're just, you're just two men bent on murdering folks to make your own pain go away. Living life like that, that sounds a hell of a lot like being damned. You know what he's capable of? Fort Resurrection. He's holed up there. I guess you two can finally have it out once and for all. And I gotta be honest with you, I don't even know who I'm pulling for. Either way, you'll have company soon. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Uh, I don't know. I'm starting to burn. I best be getting back on the ground. Listen to me. They talk about you down here. You do yourself a favor. You stay ahead of death as long as you can, you hear? Because they got plans for you. Take care, Jim. See you soon. <laughs>